welcome to my youtube channel my name is Paula Mai. this is a channel where we make the quickest easiest meal with, uh, with quick recipes and uh, if you're new in our channel please feel free to subscribe thank you so much for the many subscriptions you've been, you've been able to gather we're also grateful for the comments the feedback we are getting the likes and uh, every other share that you have gotten we want to say thank you hats off for all of you guys and today we are going to we have a new recipe which is plantain muffins so we are going to be i'll be introducing you to our ingredients shortly so let's go to our ingredients baking powder all the dry ingredients have been put together and sieved like you can see on your screens i have sieved them so to ensure that you incorporate as much air as possible and then we also have um three slightly overripe uh, plantain bananas i've already filled one so I want to mash them using a fork. You can choose to blend in a blender, but I choose to use my fork to mash them. Then we also have um, a half a cup of margarine. These are the cups I use to measure. They are readily available at the supermarket. So one side is a cup, the other side is a teaspoon or tablespoon clearly indicated here. Yeah. And then we also have uh, half a cup of milk. This is half a cup of milk. Then we also have two eggs. Two eggs are right here. We have vanilla. We shall we'll be measuring a half teaspoon of the vanilla essence. And we also have uh, some sugar here, granulated sugar. This is uh, uh, one and a half cups. No, this is half a cup, sorry. I will uh, ensure I pin all the ingredients on my description box so that if you want to try this recipe, you can try it together. So we will begin by uh, uh mixing our margarine with sugar with our mixer here so let's get to it we mashed uh the plantain yeah like i said the plantain bananas can be very stubborn so if you don't want to use your fork always you can choose to use your mixer to mash it or even uh the blender but i prefer I prefer the fork because I love to bite a few chunks of the bananas in my cake. So our banana is good. So we're gonna set it aside. Yeah, so we have our dry, dry ingredients aside. We put our banana aside. And now let's start working on our waste ingredients. So I'm gonna put this margarine into my mixer. If you do not have a mixer, always feel free to mix with your with a fork or even a whisk it works pretty well yeah. so I'm gonna put my measure in here already measured and pour my graduated sugar and then I'm gonna Mix them until they are well mixed.
so we our baking tin is ready to go into the oven but i just thought that uh, i have some nuts in the house you can add just a few nuts on top of every muffin just to enhance its taste so we're gonna add a few of the nuts at the top of every muffin this is peanut i'm using peanut so if you have almond nuts if you have cashew nuts if you have macadamia nuts macadamia nuts just feel free to use whichever kind of nuts that you have yeah because for us it's all about making it as nutritious as possible and more so making it a delicacy so i'm gonna put this into the oven now and let's see what results we're going to have but before we do we also need to wipe out this that has uh, spilled over our tin so that uh, it doesn't spoil the yeah and so now we're taking this straight to the oven and allow it to cook for 15 minutes so our oven is set at 220 degrees celsius and we are setting it for of course our heat distribution is up and down then we are setting it for 15 minutes yeah that is 15 minutes so our preheated oven there you go We leave it for 15 minutes and come check. Uh, the results look pretty impressive. So let's see whether they are ready. Yeah. So the easiest way to check if your cupcakes are ready is to put in If it comes out clean like ours, then they are ready. But if it comes out with stains, then you know it's not ready. And in our case, our cupcakes are ready. So we are going to put them on this rack. Again, take note of how our rack is. We have air circulating under the rack. So we're going to slowly place them, them here and allow them to cook, uh, to cool, to cool slowly. Now guys, to the moment that we've all been waiting for. It's that time when we get to open up our end result and first confirm if it's well cooked. Then secondly, we're gonna taste it. Give it a taste that you require. And so clearly, you can all see that our plantain muffins are perfectly done. You can see the bananas, you can see it's perfectly done, guys. So I would like us to taste. Anybody around here who want to test with me? I guess there's no one. So let's go. Let me do this for you. Ah, the aroma. Magnificent. Mmm. Mmm. The nuts. They are completing the entire taste of these muffins, guys. This is a recipe without a doubt you've got to try. And again, if you're new again, you're new here, please feel free to subscribe, share, and of course comment. And until next time, bye bye.